blow the legs off of that one. You know, I just started recording when you said that. I know, I heard it. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. Good morning, guys. Welcome to day nine of Vlogmas. And today I'm gonna be doing a full day of eating for you guys. So I hope y'all enjoy. It's my high carb day. And in case you're interested, uh, some of you might be, my macros today are looking like 155 grams of protein, 325 carbs, and 55 grams of fat. So I got a lot of carbs to eat. You hear that? I heard that. Carbs. Yeah. Carbies. You hear that, Buzz? Carbs. God, you're so cute. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> Don't burp at me, <laughs> nasty. Okay, let's get this day started. Okay, starting out the morning with some Dunkin' jo Dunkin' Donuts white chocolate peppermint oh, coffee with uh, two cups of cashew milk, a little bit of this these uh, stevia drops, and caramel pecan syrup. And seriously, this is like this much cashew milk and about this much coffee which is how I like it. I'm actually cooking some pinto beans. That guy over there said that if I make this recipe, he will eat beans all day, every day. So we will hold him to that. What are you doing, Matt? <laughs> wait, 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 Buzz, 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 where is he? Where is he, Buzz? Where is he? Go see, where is he, Buzz? Call him again. Buzz. Where is he, Buzz? <gasps> oh my god, he knows there's sound right there. Buzz? He heard you. <laughs> Where is he? <laughs> Where is he, Buzz? Buzz? He's not over there. <gasps> go see, go. No, he's, he's over here. No, kitty, nobody asked you. Buzz, come on. Other cabinet. <laughs> I I don't know where he is. You have to find him. <laughs> oh oh. What? What's he doing in there? <laughs> oh my goodness. Hello. Oh. <laughs> Okay, so this is my breakfast, and this is two packets of this sugar-free maple and brown sugar oatmeal. And then I did one serving of TVP, textured vegetable protein, and then I added a little bit of this vanilla syrup to it, so I've got that. And then I'm gonna have a little more coffee with some of the syrup, so having that for breakfast. I don't know what our plans are from here. I'm still waiting on these ding beans to cook. It's been raining like crazy outside, so we're hoping that it slows down so we can actually go climbing soon. Here is my pre-climbing lunch. I've got um, spinach, it's probably a little less than 100 grams. Two servings of these Morningstar Farms chicken strips, which are really, really good, I love those. Some sauteed onions and mushrooms that I had already ready in the fridge, and a tablespoon of nutritional yeast. So, a lot of good protein, a lot of good micronutrients in this. I'm gonna eat this, Matt's hanging out, and then we're gonna go climbing. All right, so my lunch is done and I'm gonna have a little bit of this uh, pre-workout and drink it on our way to the rock gym and as we climb. This is the Honey Badger Performance Energy Wild Berry Super Low Free Naturally Sweetened Pre-Workout. This one's pretty good. Um, it's not my favorite pre-workout, but it's one of those that I kind of bought on a whim at the store and it was not expensive at all, so. Just decided to give it a try. Uh, it doesn't do a whole lot, which I kind of like because it's good for climbing. And yeah, so I'm gonna have some of this. And then we're gonna go climbing. And then we're gonna go to the store. Got some stuff to get, including pizza for tonight. So see y'all at the Rock Gym. Actually, see y'all at the Rock Gym this time.
direct him. This is a uh, Jen. See the camera? Isn't that cool? <laughs> uh, that's the uh, future sister-in-law right there. But we're doing some hangboard stuff, so Matt's gonna show y'all how awesome that is. Ready? What? Go. We just got done at the grocery store. Um, picked up some stuff for dinner and Matt's having a <laughs> nice little tortilla on the way home. <laughs> um, but I grabbed these world peas. I really, really like these. They're uh, little chickpeas with some seasonings on them. I have it logged that I'm gonna eat the whole bag. We'll see how far I get into it. Bag is, I mean, it's a good amount of food, but I'm pretty dang hungry. We're gonna go home, we're gonna make pizzas. I'm gonna show you guys, of course. And yeah, it's a nasty, nasty day outside. Y'all can see, nasty. It's only, it's not even six and it's dark, but we're gonna make it home safely with our little tree. I'm actually about to turn this off. This is too bright. I told you guys earlier we were making a bunch of beans. Look at all of the beans that we ended up with. I think we're good for... What are you doing back there? Sounds like you're tap dancing. <laughs> um, Man, how long do you think it'll take to eat, you, eat these beans? Two days. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm gonna freeze. So these are like a um, chipotle spicy bean and then these are just regular pinto beans these are more for me these are more for matt um i'm gonna freeze four of these and then keep this for this week and then just take them out as i need so they don't go bad but hopefully he'll eat all of these before they go bad today we picked up um, these Gardein, what is this, sizzling Szechuan beefless strips. We have not tried these before. Matt's gonna put them on his pizza. Hey Matt, what's up? Hey. Yeah, made it weird. That was what's weird. Up? So we're gonna try those. Um, I've got them cooked, got some of them cooked um, from the toast oven. And it's an interesting looking little thing. I don't know if the camera's gonna focus on this. Kinda, sorta. Looks like a little nugget. I'm just gonna eat the whole piece. Get the whole piece of my, oh, my like nugget. Good. They're not eating my nuggets. That's delicious. Is it? Yes. Is it gonna go good on a pizza? I think those will go good on anything. Yeah. Matt, try this. Okay. Ready? Romantic. Oh, no, I got it. I got it. <laughs> oh, shoot. Isn't that good? It's a little squishy, but besides that, yeah. it's good. I mean, I don't mind squishy. So like if you're looking for the replacement. I don't of, mind squishy. Of beef. <laughs> if you're looking for a replacement of beef, it's not quite that. Right. It's not quite like a beefy, <laughs> it's not a beefy texture. Um, I guess that would be more chewy, which I never like that anyway. It's squishy, but it's good. Yeah, those are good. These guys. Feel free to give them a try. Pizzas are underway. Buzz is ready. Buzz, do you see yourself? Can't tell if you're looking at me or the camera. Biff. <laughs> Matt's, and he's just got his crust, which is um, a actual made crust, like he mixed the dough and everything, with some, some kind of go veggie cheese, Parmesan cheese, and those beefless Szechuan thingies chopped up. So it looks pretty good. But the mine is a thin crust. That's a store-bought thin crust. Spinach, nutritional yeast, seasonings, uh, sauce, of course, and some Beyond Meat grilled strips. So I will be eating this whole pizza. It's not that impressive. Matt will be eating this whole pizza. That's more impressive. And then dessert afterwards. Why dessert? Why you point that thing at me? 
Because I was wondering if you were having dessert. Oh, uh, no, nah, I'm probably sick with that. That's my dessert, really. Beer. Beer. Yeah. So, yeah, I'm going to plate this and show you guys. All right, so obviously the plate is not big enough. <laughs> but this is my pizza, and I think I'm going to do it like a little flatbread thing and fold it. I'm just going to eat it. I think it's going to be quite delicious. So we're going to go eat this. Matt and I admittedly have never watched Game of Thrones. We have the first four seasons on DVD. We're going to get started tonight, so I will probably report back to you whenever we become officially obsessed with that show. Apparently it's like okay. Apparently people like it. So I guess we'll hop on the train and... Do you notice <laughs> that we're like same thing? We're red shirts. I'm changing. We're so cute. We're so cute. Are you cutting your pizza? Are you cutting your pizza? Why don't you stare at yourself? <laughs> okay, right, guys, so it is dessert time and I'm having these two glorious bowls right here. This is two packets of sugar-free apple cinnamon oatmeal with four tablespoons of this better than peanut butter spread, all heated up into this delicious bowl of gooey, warm goodness. And then this is just a little bit of chocolate fudge brownie protein sludge one tablespoon of eggnog, epic spreads, nut butter, and one serving of French toast crunch. All in this little bowl. So I'm pretty excited about this dessert. Um, one of my favorite things is taking the rest of my macros for the day and just making them into like a hodgepodge of desserts of sorts. And after everything today, my macros come out to be 157 grams of protein, 326 grams of carbs and 55 grams of fat and if you guys remember the beginning of this video I mentioned my goals were 155 protein 325 carbs and 55 fat so probably the closest I've been to my macros in years you guys were here to witness that so thank you for being here for this occasion um, I really do appreciate you guys tuning in I'm gonna go enjoy this we're about 20 minutes into um, episode one of Game of Thrones so I'm excited to keep going on the series and get started on it. As always, if you did enjoy this video, if you enjoy these full day of eating videos, thumbs up, leave me some comments below, let me know your thoughts, and yeah, stay tuned for another episode of Vlogmas. More full day of eatings to come, more workouts, uh, more holiday fun. So thank you guys for tuning in, and I will see y'all tomorrow.